All right, so this one bothers me. And the reason it bothers me is because you steal somebody's Camaro ZL1, Chevrolet Camaro ZL1, 650 horsepower, V8, supercharged monster. You steal somebody's Chevrolet Camaro ZL1, get into a police chase with the car, do not know how to handle the car, let alone drive the car, lose control, crash out, and then you just want to give up like it's nothing. Put your hands in the air. I'm sorry I made a mistake. I'm giving up. This man's car is completely totaled, all because you wanted to have fun in a car that you couldn't handle from jump. This bothers me, man. But let's just go ahead and get into it, man. This is a crazy one. What's up guys, it's your boy Knockout360 here with another video, man. So you can tell I'm in a house that makes us a house vlog. You know what's going down when I come around, let's get into it. Car content, car shows, car reviews, car meets, anything and everything car related happens on this channel. So if you're into that, make sure that you stick around because you're in the right place for everyone else. Hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell so that you know what's coming out and when it's coming out. So first and foremost, shout out to County Boys uh, YouTube channel. Like, subscribe, comment, go over there, check out their content, crazy stuff. What bothers me most about this is the fact that it's a stolen muscle car. I hate stolen muscle cars. Let's get into it. <laughs> County boys, shout them out. Look at this. So clearly we got a Camaro Z01 in the right-hand lane. And then we've got Clayton County's Blackhawk unit. All right. So he gets behind them. This cop's still using a Garmin. What is this, a Garmin? 2024, you still using a Garmin GPS device? Okay. All right, so he lights them up. Lights his ass up. Takes off on them. Camaro got the hell out of Dodge quickly. All right. That Camaro got the hell out of Dodge quickly. That Camaro probably got out of Dodge faster than any Hellcat that I've ever seen. I mean, within six, seven seconds, that Camaro was gone. Damn. That thing is gone. Five. Look at old dumbass. Look at the poles down. Old dumbass. Look at all the poles. Follow the smoke. Look at the smoke. Mind you, they can't see the car, but they can see the smoke coming from the damn car. Follow the smoke. You hear what the cops said? Follow the smoke. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. There you go. Old dumbass. Old dumbass. Look at that Camaro. Total. Look at that Camaro. Total. That Camaro sound good too. That was the foot chase. That cop moving. up you didn't got into a police chase with clayton county's black hog unit in a 650 horsepower v8 and you just giving up 
Because you don't know what like that's what bothers me. Let's get let's watch it. I'm sorry. This bothers me. That's what bothers me the most. I'm fast forward. Look at the look at the ZL1, bro. I'm not even a Chevy guy, but I've got so much respect for the ZL1. Trust me when I say I used to try ZL1s all the time in my scat pack, and they used to, you know, they would put me in my place. Um, look what he did to the Z. Oh my God. What bothers me the most about this one is it's just the fact that you stole a man's car. And nine times out of ten, this ZL1 was his dream car. Let's be real here. Z01s are not cheap. They've never been cheap. They're easily what? What, what would you say? Eighty, ninety thousand dollars, maybe even a hundred, depending on where you go. Eighty, ninety, a hundred thousand dollar muscle car, and you steal it just to get into a high speed chase for all of a minute and a half, maybe two minutes, and you lose control because you don't know what the fuck you're driving. You don't realize that you're driving a six hundred and fifty horsepower V eight supercharged rear wheel drive muscle car. This car is specifically designed not only for the drag strip. The thing about the Z01, to my understanding, and correct me if I'm wrong, is they, on, they not only are they specifically designed for the drag strip, but these cars are designed for the track, especially when you get into the 1LE. Like the 1LE, to my understanding, is specifically designed for the track. Like it's designed to hit the corners. Now, this is just a ZL1, but either way, it's still capable of hitting those corners hard. And somehow or another, you totaled it. Out of the GT500, the Hellcat, the Demon, and the Z01, the Z01 is by far the most capable when it comes to the track, when it comes to high speed, turns, maneuvers, so on and so forth. And somehow or another, you crash it. You stole this man's dream car just to crash it after a minute and a half because you didn't know what the fuck, you didn't know what you were driving. You didn't know what you were getting yourself into. And that's what bothers me the most, is the fact that you stole this man's car, crashed out in it, and then you just gave up. There's a word that I want to use, but I'm not going to use it because of YouTube. But, I mean, you gave up like a, like a, you know what? You know what? You gave up like a B-I-T-C-H. I'm not even going to say it. I'm going to spell it out. You take Clayton County on all of, all of a two-minute chase. Lose control because you don't know what you're doing. Because you can't drive. You're just a clown behind a 650 horsepower muscle car. Crash out. And now this man is out of, you know, a dream car. And then you just want to give up. You don't even want to chase. You don't even want to run no more. You don't even want to, you know, actually make them work for the, for the chase. Give up. Hands up. Just get on your hands and knees. That bothers me, man. That's why I go out of my way to secure my car. I told you guys numerous times. I bought my Hellcat on a Saturday. I had a security appointment Wednesday morning. I bought my T-Rex on a Tuesday. I had my security appointment on a Wednesday morning. Like, I'm not going to allow some dumbass who doesn't know how to handle my car to steal my shit, get into a high-speed chase with CMPD just to crash my shit on W.T. Harris and South Tryon. You know what I mean? Like, that bothers me. It bothers me that you stole my Z01, got into a high-speed chase for all of a minute and a half, two minutes, just to crash out. A eighty, ninety, dollars $100,000 car. I think Z01s at one point were going for 100000 I could be mistaken. A little clo a close to hundred, maybe ninety. I think Z01s have always been more expensive than Hellcats. I could be wrong. Let me know if I'm wrong. But you crashed my $90,000 ZL1. Because you don't know how to drive it. Like, I'm done. Like, that bothers me. I'm glad this guy got caught. I'm glad he's behind bars. I hope he's still behind bars. You know what I mean? I don't, like, I I'm so glad Clayton County Sheriff's Department did what they were supposed to do. The Black Hawk Unit, successful. Successful job, Black Hawk Unit. Bravo. Put this clown in jail. Because this right here is clown behavior. You stole a man's car just to crash out two minutes later. You've got all the power and the prowess in the world. More so than a Hellcat. Because you know, like I know, Hellcats go fast straight. 
We go fast in a straight line. That's it. We're not turning corners, right? Even scat packs. We're not turning corners. We go fast in a straight line. But the ZL1, that's a track-focused muscle car. That's a car that can get on the track and do what it's supposed to do, but it can also meet you on the drag strip too. It's still 650 horsepower of a supercharged V8. But somehow or another, this guy wasn't able to handle it. This is clown behavior, man. I don't support clown behavior in any way, shape, form, or fashion. Shout out to Clayton County Sheriff's Department. They did exactly what they were designed to do. Took this guy down. Um, I hate that, you know, the rightful owner of this Z01 um, no longer has this car, unfortunately. But maybe he'll get a Hellcat. You know, maybe he'll upgrade. Maybe he'll come to his senses and say, you know what? Instead of all this playing around, I'm just going to go out and get my dream car, which is a Hellcat jailbreak charger or a red eye or demon. Get a real car. You know what I'm saying? Leave all this Chevy stuff behind. I'm just being funny. You know what I mean? Shout out to the Chevy boys. I got nothing but respect, especially for the Z01. Z01s have smoked me plenty of times, but that was in my scat pack, not my Hellcat. But, um, yeah, this clown is behind bars where he deserves to be. Um, I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. Yeah, I'm cool with this all day long. Simple and plain. Shout out to Clayton County. Shout out to County Boys for the video. Like, subscribe, comment. It's Benny Boy Knockout 360, man. Stop stealing these damn cars. Especially cars that you can't handle. If you can't handle it, you don't need to be stealing it. Simple and plain. Peace.